All right, we're going to uh, start adding color next into this and uh, see how it goes from there. Okay, we're back. I've mixed up a light brown is yellow ochre. Uh, didn't have the exact color, so I added some yellow to a light brown ochre itself. And we're going to mist over all this white to uh, give the light yellowish brown look to the fur. And then we'll be going in with darks after that. I don't have to worry too much about overspray because it's going to blend right into the shirt so you won't notice it. It's mainly to tone down these whites and get the underlying fur. We'll also mist over with some pure yellow. In areas. This is a transparent, so it's not going to cover up anything completely. We're just really just concentrating on misting over everything. Normally for doing something like this, I definitely wear my mask, but I want to be able to talk so you can hear what I'm saying about the painting and what I'm working on.
There's a little bit of yellowish brown coming through in the white of the nose area, so I'm still going to mist over that and then I'll rebuild my whites again later. Going a little bit heavier down here because it's going to end up darker. And Get this horn out here. Very easy to overlook it. Right, we're getting a nice rich yellowy brown. Don't want to overwork too much. Spraying at about 25 to 30 PSI with my Iwata Eclipse CS and I'm using the uh, 0.35 needle. Okay. That looks pretty good. Yeah, I got to see another spot. A little bit more of the yellowish brown. It's over here on the bridge of the nose. 